I love this construction work. It's it's a building under construction, but the colors they used for for the scaffoldings make it work already. It looks like a finished product. in the morning I guess my plan of recharging works because I haven't woken this early for weeks now I'm gonna check out the hotel breakfast it's a bit creepy but looks like the only, I'm the only guest doing this Who'd have thought that the camera was already here and recording? I've discovered that my hotel has a pool, so now you're joining me on the passionate journey of buying swimming trunks. The store didn't have them. Oh, look, there's a line store. I just love line merchandise. So cute. For those of you who don't know, LINE is the most popular messaging app in Japan. It was financed by Korean money, uh, but it was developed in Japan. And it's by far the most popular app for messaging in Japan. Korean equivalent of LINE is called Kakao Talk. Everybody in Korea is using Kakao. They're competing, but they're basically ripping each other off to a ridiculous extent. So you saw there's this line store uh, and the line of products called Line Friends. Unsurprisingly, Kakao has a line of products called Kakao Friends. Personally, I'm team line on this because mascots of line, they're just amazingly cute. And mascots of Kakao, ugh. God damn it, no store has swimming shorts. What is this place? No luck on the swimming trunk front. I'm annoyed. We've been getting repetitive questions about vegetarian and vegan food in Tokyo and guess what I found? A whole section on vegan and vegetarian restaurants in the newest metropolis, which is awesome. So I'm gonna go check out this place today with some vegetarians. I don't mind summer rain when you can wear shorts and your legs dry off, but autumn rain when the bottom of your pant legs get all wet and soggy. Blah. It's beans. beans. Yeah. And looks like chili sauce stuff. I hope so. I wish you had a lazy Susan. Alright, so you guys were vegans in Sweden, yeah? Yeah. yeah. And here? How does that work? It's way too hard here. Except when we're cooking at home. It's, yeah, yeah then we it's mostly vegan, but outside it's too fucking hard. In Japan, being a vegetarian or being a vegan is considered a health choice. Like, mm. it is not a lifestyle choice. It's uh, you're just being healthy. You want to get into shape. You want to lose some weight. When, for us foreigners, it's it's a lifestyle choice. Like you've made this decision. Okay, so I also <laughs> have a burger with fried something, and we all have nice animals holding our burgers together. I have a sheep. Make make as many noises yeah. as you can. Delicious, sexy burgers. It was good enough to where I didn't even realize I wasn't eating meat. So, stop picking on us. We don't just eat rice. <laughs> What's good? What's good? So delicious. Everyone's satisfied. Yes. Except we want ice cream. Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. This vacation of mine so far consists mostly of me working, only not 
blogging working or editing working, just email working. Yesterday I caught myself telling my coworker in Poland, completely unaware of what I'm saying, I said, the following few days I can work a bit more because I'm having vacation. We have a case of a workaholic here. I ended up in the same hotel restaurant for dinner because I don't want to go out today too much. This is a pretty amazing deal. You pay about $40 and have unlimited food, including like lobsters, Chinese food, sushi, unlimited sashimi, pizza. Wow. There's also cakes. This place is not good for diet. It was a ridiculous dinner. I've had like 13 different proteins, I think. I've had chicken, duck, eel, a uh, few types of sashimi, pork, beef, shrimp, crab, lobster. Small bites of everything, but still, I feel like a pig. Oscar has just been slammed in the face with a cold stone dilemma. I can have that one, that one, and maybe that one. Are you guys getting a song? <laughs> I feel like a kid again. <laughs> All right, what do you guys think of your first Cold Stone song? I will be back. Mm. One last note about vegans and vegetarians. Two, two last notes. Two notes. One, Indian restaurants, most of them are vegetarian, so that's a good option. Two, there is a Facebook group called Tokyo Vegan Slash Vegetarian Club, and they usually post things about new restaurants or dinner sets or lunch sets that are all vegan vegan and vegetarian friendly and people will translate things for you. Bye bye guys! Enjoy doing your homework! <sighs> That's all for me today guys. See you all tomorrow.